Son! It was a moonlit night. <laughs> Henry was taking a goods train to the station by the... Are you afraid of... Rubbish. They're only... Rubbish. After all, oh. so don't let that... Rubbish. <laughs> Whenever that owl hoots, a mist rolls in, murmured Edward. What's happening? There's a legend that when the mist's about, there's a roast about too. Take care on the old line, Henry. Stupid bird, said Henry. Stupid Henry, said owl. Stupid owls, stupid mists, stupid ghosts. Edward's going soft at the boiler. There's no rubbish. Rubbish. What's that? James the James the nosed engine. But Henry was wrong. <laughs> What's that? cried Henry. It's an amber lamp, murmured his driver. That means proceed. Whee! He stopped by a tree. It had a bananas nailed to a piece of plywood. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, there's an orange on his banana board? The driver was surprised. No one warned us about that before. And look, the signal's mm. red. It can't. And the gates caught fire. A a a and there's a fogman's coat. But where is its owner? Then they saw a light move within the station building. <laughs> Gross! exclaimed Henry. Edward was right. Something very strange is happening, said his driver. I think it's best we go back. So, so, agreed Henry. <laughs> A workman was talking about the unsafe viaduct. Lucky you didn't cross it last night. Yes, but we don't know who warned us. Don't be so daft, said that a sign. You did not. Said that a signal. Yes, I did. You did not. Yes, I did. Didn't. <laughs> yes, I did. Didn't. <laughs> yes, I did. Later that day, he spoke to Henry. The Fitness Gram Pacer Test is a multi-stage aerobic capacity test that progressively gets more difficult as it continues. Henry really didn't want to. But when nightfall came, he was sizzling nicely. Suddenly, a stupid bird hooted, and then Gordon thundered by. Oh, look! Henry spooked, said a freight car. <laughs> Quiet, snapped Henry. I'm not scared. But he was. A little later, the fog came down. As they approached the same area, they saw the amber light again. Here we go, said Henry's driver. Then, unknown to Henry, the gates mysteriously closed by themselves. The gates mysteriously closed by themselves. Closed by themselves. And the signal went red. The freight cars had seen everything, and they were spooked. Faster, faster, there's a roast about. That's not funny. Stop, stop, yelled Henry. A mysterious figure watched Henry go by. Henry braked hard, but the freight cars hit some of the rubbish. Rubbish. Just then, Henry's driver saw a strange sight coming towards them. What was that? What's that? He said. The fireman laughed. <laughs> That's our ghost, the Brothers Grimm. Smashed, broken, and sunk. It's Old Bailey, the Fogman. Old Bailey was Crocs. Well, I tried to warn you about the viaduct. Why didn't you pay attention? Fogman! <laughs> Is there anything we can do to thank you? I'd like to operate that rubbish. <laughs> and in a little while, Old Bailey's wish was Bailey. You and your station will be really useful, said Sir Topham Hatt. Let's hear a hearty thank you to the friendliest, uh, roast on the island. 
everyone cheered, especially Henry, who was the happiest of all. <laughs>